urban growth exceeds government capacity. Uh, it's funny that, the, in a sense, cities are such centres of innovation, of investment, of, of new um, social learning, of, of political innovation. Um, but the cities have grown faster than the capacity of the government actually to, to manage them. Um, we should actually see urbanization as a very positive thing. It's almost asso always associated with a stronger, more successful economy. But it needs, needs a government to respond. And, you know, you, uh, we, you go to Mumbai, you go to Bangalore, these are very successful cities. But a large part of that population isn't finding housing they can afford, and so they form slums, informal settlements. Now, the government should have got round to responding to this, because it's been evident for 30 to 40 years. But, but they haven't on the scale that's needed. Um, so for me, the problems of Mumbai, of, of Bangalore, of Hyderabad, of other successful cities in Asia, is how to build a governance structure that can cope with their economic success. One of the critical research questions is to, to, document, um, to, to document the informal settlements, to document the informal economies. Um, oddly enough, it's a technique that the federations of slum and shack dwellers use to demonstrate you know, that they're real people, they're working in the city economy, the city economy would collapse without them, they're building their own homes, they have enormous initiative themselves. If government worked with them and saw them as the positive force that it should, um, you can do remarkable things. You can improve water, you can improve sanitation, you can improve housing, support housing and finance. Um, and as you do so, so the governance capacity of a city will come to match the population of a city. I think IIHS is a very exciting initiative, very important initiative. Um, if India continues with its economic success, it's going to urbanize rapidly. Um, now, it's not as if there aren't some outstanding urban scholars and some outstanding urban um, civil servants in India, but you need to multiply them 20-fold, 30-fold, 40-fold. And so IIHS is going to fill an enormously important need, actually building the staff for federal government, for state government, for municipal government, to cope with this rapid urbanization. There's just so many opportunities to, to rethink the curriculum um, or a, a variety of curricula. So um, it, it, some are suitable for researchers, some are suitable for um, mid-career professionals, some are suitable for very senior officials. Um, what IAHS have done too, which I think is very nice, is that they've drawn in some of the most innovative um, uh, universities and university courses in the world, looked at them, examined their relevance, took the best bits, ignored the inappropriate bits, and then built on their own innovation and knowledge.